Ooh, allude the Tower of Illusion. It's falling. You see that? <coughs> it fell near justice. That's a lot of illusion that's been going on here. And it's falling. What is the hermit? These cards are flying out. The lovers. Illumination of the, who, who the true two, two of cups is. And who the third party was that caused the heartbreak. Woo, child. So. So the, the, the lovers, okay. The, somebody, the illumination of who the true connection is. The true twin flame divine connection is. Yep, it's about to be illuminated. The two of cups, okay. The devil, okay. So that was a karmic. That played in that played in your energy as the two of cups. This karmic bought into the devil to, to build a contract with the devil. They owe the devil a contract because this person sold their soul for your connection. Wow. Yep, it's about to be into this person. Some of them, um, they're there for them selling their soul for the connection they're in is an alignment. Yep, some type of heart attack or some type of issue with their heart. This person could have been trying to play with your heart, causing issues with you to unalive you. If you guys had any issues with your health, that's probably what it was with this karmic. Whoever this third party was here. Mm-hmm. Yep, that's what we got going on here. What's the higher for the reverse? Yep, the Queen of Cups. In reverse, this person was not you. This person was not of God, divine feminine, was not chosen to be divine feminine. This person wanted to be divine feminine. That's what this person wanted to be. This person, this this copycat, like I told you guys, in both readings, and every reading is coming up. Male or female, take it how it resonates. But there's a lot of copycat energy here, too. The illusion's over out in the cold. The situation here is coming to an end. So whoever this is that's been that that owed the devil, that that uh, sold their soul for the devil. Is or to the devil to have your life to choose for this person to steal your person or whatever happened with your situation could be family or friends too as well. We look like a, we look like a relationship here though, yeah. Because we got two of cups and the devil. This person wanted your life so bad they sold it. So yeah, they did. This person sold their soul for so so their soul for your life. Mm hmm. What's going on here? The devil. What I say? The tower. The, the unalivement. It's an ending. A heavy ending. And we got it on both ends. Unalivement. This situation, this person, this, this is going to be a lot of people passing away because of what was sold to steal your life. Yeah. Because there was a lot of, there was a lot of dirt done towards your health. Towards you. Towards your destiny. Towards your happiness. Yeah, it was. They were trying to destroy you and get rid of you. Yep. The uh, Ten of Cups in reverse. Illumination. It was a karmic relationship. Yep. The lover. Somebody chose the wrong path. And it's the, the, the reason why they chose the wrong path, there was major manipulation here. Somebody's trying to literally get rid of you. They were foolish. The fool. To literally get rid of you because you are the true divine person. That's why God is in reverse with this situation here because the devil was over this connection. It's about to be a real truth about the devil versus God and connections. Most people, like I told you, a lot of people are in karmic relationships and don't even know it. Yeah. If stuff is not working, a divine connection should be peaceful. It should flow. It does not have any third party energy in it. It don't have any cheating. No um, imbalance. It don't have any of that going on. No toxicity whatsoever. And most, and most people, when we, when we come back here, we are all karmic. Everybody is. So if you don't heal, you're going to you're gonna get a karmic lesson through relationships. And a lot of people get caught up in their trauma bonding and, and, and talking about it's a connection, but it's really karma. 90% of the people that I work with, they are, the connections are bad. They're not kar they're karmic relationships, so they're not healed. If you're not healed, you have a karmic relationship. What's the devil? It's in the wands. Yep. Yeah. That's that this person, this karmic was a burden. Mm hmm. Somebody thought that they were the uh, two of cups, they were actually nothing but a burden. This person was nothing but, but, but drag a drag and a weight around their leg and their neck. Mm hmm. The, that this karmic is carrying a burden, was carrying a burden of this situation the whole time because they sold their soul to get your life and they trusted in the devil to get it. 
They were very sure that they were going to get, they were going to get the execution of your life. The situation is going to come down with the destiny here, but it backfired. Five of, when I tell you five of swords, it's backfiring. This person is about to be defeated with um, this, this third party. Is it going to be defeated with some type of hard problems? Mm-hmm. This person did unalive and magic on you, trying to cause um, an ending to you through your heart space or through your health. Whatever they did to you is coming back to the maxim maximize. This person has issues in their health. If they don't, now they're going to have it. And also, anybody who is involved in their family is going to have it as well. Yep, the situation is karma. Seven of Pentacles in reverse. Yes, it is. This is seven of pentacles in reverse. The situation's coming down here. God is, um, this is reaping season. 